And that is what you bring into the room in your first 10 seconds. Hi, my name is Steve Blanchard, and I'm an actor. Over 40 years, I've had the pleasure of performing on Broadway, in television, and in films. Along the way, I've picked up some bits and tips I'd love to share with you. They've certainly helped me. Starting a career in acting can be both exhilarating and daunting. For young actors, stepping into the world of performance, the journey is filled with opportunities, challenges, and a constant need for growth. If you've made it to this point, I assume you're passionate about what you do, committed, and hungry for more. Auditioning. This is one of the craziest parts of our business. It can be terrifying to walk into a room and perform a piece completely out of context, not having gone through the two and a half hours of a play when your fantastic monologue occurs. But as a dear friend always told me, go in with the mantra, I get to act today. Going through a specific pre-room process helps build the essential skills you'll need year after year. Preparation. Know your material inside and out. I always try to know the words cold, but don't hang on to a specific reading. Because you'll always be redirected into a different angle of the material. There's always a moment of discovery in a reading. The character suddenly realizes something they've never known. Let them see that, whether in monologues, songs, or scenes. Choose material that is rarely seen or heard. Casting folks hear a lot of the same stuff. Try coming at the material from the opposite direction. A traditionally happy monologue or song would become the most fearful, scariest thing their character could ever think of. Or a dark, angry piece could be portrayed as an expression of love. You get it. As I said previously, you already don't have the job before you go in. So if you don't book the gig, you haven't really lost anything. So go for it. If you go into the room and try to get the character instead of trying to get the job, the jobs will come. Promise. Walking into the room. Let's be honest. The first 10 seconds upon your entry, you've been sized up and categorized. So just be yourself. You are unique. Even in a cattle call, you will still stand out because no one else is quite like you. Stillness is power. Have you ever watched chaos on stage and there's one actor completely motionless? You can't take your eye off them. Embrace your stillness. Follow directions. Directors appreciate actors who can follow directions and adapt their performance according to feedback. Stay confident and relaxed. Auditions can be nerve-wracking, but maintaining confidence and staying relaxed can significantly impact your performance. Have fun and focus on delivering your best performance rather than worrying about the outcome. As an actor, reputation matters. Reliability and a positive attitude can make a lasting impression on directors and casting agents. Be open to feedback. Constructive criticism is a valuable part of the learning process. Use this feedback to improve your performance and grow as an actor. Find your niche. As you gain experience, you may discover specific types of roles or genres that suit you best. Embrace your unique qualities and strengths and focus on roles that align with your natural abilities and interests. Now, this might be an acquired skill, but I learned that you have no idea what they're looking for. You're either right for the role or you're not. Don't try to guess what you think they want. 
The attitude of, if you like me, hire me. If you like someone else more, hire them, really goes a long way. Build your brand. Develop a unique identity and style that sets you apart from the other actors. This could involve specializing in a particular type of role or developing a distinctive performance style. Your individuality is your greatest asset. And that is what you bring into the room in your first 10 seconds. Expect rejections. Rejection is a common part of the acting profession. Learn to handle rejection gracefully and use it as a learning experience. You have no idea what's coming your way. How many times have you wanted a job so badly and then were crushed because you didn't get it? But then the job of a lifetime came along that you wouldn't have been able to accept had you gotten the other gig. When you see the same people audition after audition, you realize sometimes they'll book the job and next time it'll be your turn. Enjoy the process. Remember that acting is a journey, not a destination. Follow your instincts and make choices that align with your personal and professional goals. Remember, every actor's journey is unique and finding your path involves continuous learning, growth, and dedication. I hope some of this helps. Let me know what more you'd like to see in the comments. And remember, what you wish for yourself, you wish for all.